Hello, in this tutorial we'll talk about one very useful plugin called WP Database Manager. As you know, WordPress is a content management system which works with database, so it's very important to have a backup of your database and this plugin manages your WordPress database. All right? So it allows you to optimize database, repair database, backup database, restore database, delete database, and drop and empty some tables in the database. Okay, so I'm using this plugin on all of my websites and my client sites. And now let's install this plugin on this particular website. Okay, so let's search in the WordPress directory. And now we will install this plugin. So let's activate the plugin now. And it's activated. So here's the menu of the plugin, and we have some options here, such as to see that the database, to backup database, to manage backup database, to optimize, to repair database, to empty and drop some tables, to run SQL query, and some other stuff. Alright, so let's Go through all of them. First of all, let's see this option empty drop tables. Instead of going to uh, PHP My Admin, you can empty or drop some database from this excellent plugin. Just choose one of these two options. Click on empty drop and you won't have these lines in the database. All right, so let's repair the database. If there are some errors, and now let's optimize it. It, should, it is suggested to use this option one, once a month, and you can back up your database whenever you're creating new posts. Okay. So let's back up our database. Here's the database name. And let's back it up. All right, so now we'll click on Manage Database Backup. And as you can see, we have some other backups from previous time. All right, so I'll just click on this one, the freshest one, and we will click on email this database. We can also download it or restore this database. So let's email this database. And now if we go to the email of this particular website, should see the database here. All right, so here's the database itself. You can always keep these databases just in case. All right, so it's very nice and light plugin. It will help you a lot. As you can see here are the tables, the records, the data user the usage and in the database options the last one you will see some paths to MySQL to MySQL dump you can set up maximum backup files also you have the option to automatically schedule the creation of the database right also, you can email this one automatically whenever the database is done. But currently, I'm not using this option. So, I would highly recommend to use this excellent plugin, and you should always have backup of your database. Thank you very much for watching, 
and you can visit my website tutorial7.com to learn more about WordPress, Joomla, web design and SEO. Thank you very much.